SoCal resident, there is going to be a SoCal Melee Arcadian May 1st. Uh, it's going to be at UCI. Type in smash.gg slash SCA 2022. And there's already like 100 attendees. It's going to be a very stacked one. I mean, it has the likes of Steech, Venelox, Calvin, Aiden Calvin, that guy. Has Zila, Greg Turbo, Yingling, for some reason. Uh, <laughs> Epic Murloc. Vertigo, PhD's nuts, ran by Cards and G, who's also entered. It's gonna be a stacked one. I mean, I personally love Arcadians because it's a chance for those that like you know we're kicking the rank players out. We don't want to see them. We want to see the new bloods rise, and that's probably like the most exciting part for me personally is seeing the new bloods. Cause like melee is a growing game, believe it or not, and thanks to Slippy keeping the game alive, like. We have all these attendees. And if you're in SoCal, don't miss out. It's probably going to be on the top shelf stream. It's going to happen soon. And um, if you're SoCal, you are missing out by uh, not attending this. So I personally think, you know, just looking at the bracket a little for the SoCal Arcadian, I think uh, Deech is probably going to win it. He's looking like the strongest unranked SoCal player right now. But if I had to get my... One dream run, I think Vertigo is going to win it. So if you're SoCal, check it out, uh, and it'll be fun. Uh, right now, I'm just waiting for Blur to get back from the restroom, and uh, Hungerbox Pipsqueak is next, and that's going to be a banger, I think. I mean, Pip has a lot of solo battle practice, um, ha does a lot of, like, he's a very strong puff player in EU, Maybe even comparable to HBox. We don't know since like Solo Battle has never traveled to the US as far as I'm concerned. So like we don't know his true strength yet. But typically Pip beats him, I believe. So I'm going to make the hard call that I think Pip's going to win this. And uh, they are starting in a bit. And uh, I think, I think uh, this is going to be as unpredictable as HBox always is, man. I think HBox is going to win this one and going to lose to Ginger. We're gonna say, "Oh my God, it is God!" And then <laughs> she's gonna get owned by JJ. It's gonna be hilarious. That, that's the roller coaster that I'm used to at this point. I'm, <laughs> I'm predicting unpredictable. I'm predicting entropy. You know, that's not even a prediction. I, I, I favor chaos. You're, you're just predicting, uh, both sides. That's not a prediction, Blur. <laughs> no, I'm saying Ginger. Oh. I, I, specifically, I think. He's going to be Pip and lose to And it's going to mm. be absurd. It doesn't make any sense. I mean, in some ways, like, it makes some amount of sense. Like, if it happened at land, would you be, like, shocked? I think uh, you would definitely be surprised. But, like, is it, like, the most shocking result? Like, I wouldn't say so, necessarily. Yeah, I mean, it wouldn't be crazy. But... Like, what's more crazier? Do you think it's Ginger over HBox or Ginger over Plup? I guess Ginger over Plop. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I'm saying. No, like I told you in the, the pre-show, didn't all Plop do pretty much to leading up to Genesis is like play adventure mode or something? <laughs> and play Elden Ring? Yeah, like... Is this that surprising that a guy who does that gets owned? I don't think so. <laughs> I don't know. Is, isn't that how it goes? Yeah, I mean... Also, Chad is saying solo battle versus Pip is 4-4. Four, 4-4? Four. Four, four. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> uh... I still believe in Pip. Alright, you're calling me out. I don't actually know anything. Uh... <laughs> uh... I don't know. Hey, it's like, it's like uh, you know... I don't know if you've done this, Blur, but, like, you know, if you want to build up... It's like, didn't you say that, like, you... Say SCJ back then when uh, SCJ was like losing to West, but it's like, oh no, I actually think SCJ has been uh, he's been beating West balls and friendlies. You know, I think he's gonna beat him. Death. What? Yeah, zero, that was a clean zero death by the honker, bah. Oh my goodness, and a, and a good one too. Dude, yeah. He's, the thing is, is the eye test is improving on him. Like yeah. he's actually doing like the old combos and like new stuff and like it's kind of cool. Yeah, did he just edge cancel that drill? Did you just see that movement? Oh my god! 
Wait, wait. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, maybe whoa. Is the second best in the world. Wait, maybe, maybe, maybe that's actually just true. Yeah, I mean, uh, he's are you just sling like, off his drills? Oh, that's smash usually up. a good, good sign. And uh, Pip <laughs> is having trouble gaining his foot, although. He needed that. He needed that if he wants any chance to win this game. But uh, that was like a beautiful minute of melee, though, from HBox. Like one of the best mm -hmm. I've ever seen. Uh, on ironic. My goodness, I thought we might see a rest. But why Dude. rest when you could just get a better combo like that? This is a, this is a cool, like ten out of ten game from HBox so far. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, making that right raid to shield because Drill does not stun Fox long enough, and uh. Fights the up air, but I'm I'm impressed that uh, yeah I'm Pip really impressed game, that Pip's even in this game at the moment. <laughs> like okay, we can't okay we we're, we're praising okay uh, no no uh, it's, 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 that was a really well played game like what yeah. was like I can't even count the number of mistakes Xbox made it was like very few. Mm -hmm. Well, that that's what I was gonna get to is that like we're praising Xbox a lot, but like what about you know the fact that. Even though HBox is making bladed mistakes, like he's still finding his way in. And uh, listen, oh my, dude, okay. This is like, he's not doing it right. But back then, HBox would just power shield more lasers than Fox would put in laser damage himself. Yeah. Like that was actually peak HBox right there, in my opinion. That like, it was people- <laughs> Oh my God, he smashed the eye too? Hello? Oh, no. Yeah, what? Okay. Oh, hey, that's old habit. That that's old habit's die hard. He he's been doing that since 2012. Mm -hmm. And can you specify what old habit for the viewers at home? It's just like he does, especially in the the corners of the stage. He does like these these like kind of brain dead like uh, back airs, mm -hmm. and a lot of top foxes catch him with up airs. Yeah. Yeah, HBox like, will always rationalize that, like, oh yeah, I do those back airs because, like, you know, my drift is faster. But, uh, yeah. No, dude, you're just staying <laughs> in. You, it's not that hard to hit you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, like, he's playing, like, a very, like, very intelligent poking game and hitting as hard as he absolutely can. A few mistakes here and there, but, yeah, no, he looks. <laughs> he's, like, not taking any unnecessary risk. He's not just, no, like, putting in, incredible. like, an idiot. He looks incredible. We have, to, we have to be real. Like, he looks very, very sharp right now. Mm hmm. Although, oh. didn't hit that ADT. Uh, oh. Wow, okay. I don't know what, I don't know if there was a move that Puff could have done to really catch Fox there. <gasps> Crouch oh canceled God. F smash? On jab? Potentially on reaction, you know? Oh, damn. Hbox secretly has, like, one of the best reactions in the game, somehow. And it's funny how like he has one of the best reactions and doesn't reaction tech chase rest as often as he could. Yeah, I, th I think the, the, there was a guy at Summit who did the testing, right? And it was like, HBox was only behind Wizzy, I think? Yeah. And it's and like, seriously? Pretty, yeah, HBox reactions are crazy. And like, I would see him play some Mario Party minigames that like requires really, really tight reactions and he would often win there. And I'm like, dude. Uh, <laughs> God damn, this guy. Yeah, but it's still a tight last talk game. Don't don't count out Pip Squeak just yet. I mean, yes, HBox been kind of dominating, but oh, oh, that missing that angle. How many years do you think until uh, the the P the Puff start light shielding against the the Fox up air shield poke? How many years is it gonna take? So when you say puffs, you mean H box, right? Just saying, they've been doing that to get kills for like a while now, and all you have to do is light shield. I don't know how. But, what about for a jump cancel grab? Oh, how many more years? Yeah, okay. uh, there's no time limit there. So <laughs> I, I think forever. I think it's the same answer there. No, it's forever, dude. It'll take him just as long as it will figure out for him to uh, implement jump cancel grab. I don't, probably never. <laughs> Maybe. But we see him do other things like drill, jump cancel rest. So way harder things. <laughs> <laughs> like he's implementing edge cancel drills, but like doesn't jump cancel rest. It makes no sense. And you know, it's very crouch cancel, very solid crouch cancel grab. Um, 
Now he's starting to throw out a little too much. Oh, why didn't he rest there? Ooh, where's the hash out? It's an F smash. Beautiful edge guard. Hungry box. Why did we doubt the age god? <laughs> well, we have every reason to doubt him. Like, don't, don't, like, oh my goodness. Beautiful SDI. I think that was like two ins. Dude, two right there. 2022 is a new year, dude. <laughs> Let's year, stop forget that. We have every valid reason to doubt HBox online. Like, literally the week before, he got double eliminated by Bobby. So it's like, it wasn't unreasonable. But. Yeah. Oh! oh! H God? Reading roll in? For breakfast? For dinner? This is what we like to see. Yeah, I love seeing this. I, I bet you his fans love seeing this the most. Do it for oh. your fans. Oh, I almost got up here. Oh my goodness! Oh, imagine if he turned around, jab, rested. And oh, this this is inevitable. Oh, oh dude, oh H box. He this looks good. so good. Like guy, here's, the, here's the thing. Um, there was a point where, like. Maybe he would do okay at these online tournaments or at, at a random land like last year. And you're like, yeah, but you know, this is not. It's like eye test. It's like, eh, it's not, you know, uh, you know he, he happened to win. But he, <gasps> oh my God. This is actual, his, the eye test looks insane on HBox right now, which is unbelievable to say. Yeah. Yeah. No, I can't believe I'm saying this, but like, I, I love seeing this HBox online set. Like. But with all due respect to Pipsqueak, you kind of got destroyed by H God. <laughs> no, my, that was. I feel like I just teleported back to 2016. 2018, 2016, the same year. Any of those? Yeah. Are we? What? Can anybody tell me what just happened? Like, did uh -oh. H Box just like drink something that like powered him up? Did he just drink enough Campbell's chicken soup to get in his major need of comeback? Okay. What? That match might be enough for me to think that this HBox first few months good results might be sustainable through the year, like inland. Like that looked really good. Like uh, this whole nonsense. I just like, didn't people, expect to see this. Like at a TNT ranked, of all things. People ranked him at the bottom end of top 10 last year. You know, they were like 8th, ninth, 10th. Yeah, and they were right. Some people put him at 11th. Yeah. Outside well, top 10. Okay, that was definitely just incorrect, but... Yeah, it was incorrect, but people did it. Um, but they, and, were, they weren't, like, totally wrong. Like, they weren't baseless. They weren't and baseless, it's like, yeah. yeah. But it's like, now I'm... I'm afraid for Ginger. Like... I'm afraid for the whole scene. This is bigger than this is this is this is, he's starting to look good. He's, he's just starting to, he's starting to look like, really good. Like there's like an there's like a world where like at low tide city it's like oh somebody could upset him. But it's like no longer I I I think what would we say? We didn't know who was gonna win low tide city, Xbox would win low tide city. <laughs> but I didn't take uh, too much. I, yeah. I I saw, I've seen enough. Xbox win low tide city. Yeah, I mean, For we're sure. going to jump straight into winning finals. And I and think see. that's going to, if he wins that, that's going to change the narrative immediately. Don't you think? Depends how he wins. Or if it's actually super important for the Melee storyline. Yeah, like, I think it kind of depends on, like, how HBox wins it. If it's, like, last stock, last hit by Axe, like, you're definitely going to get some, like, question no, marks. Still gonna, as long as he wins, I think it's going gonna, it's gonna to change the storyline. Uh, if, I think it, if he wins, it's going to be like, oh, wait a second, guys. Uh, because because he would have gotten, you know, second at pound. Uh, uh what did he get at Genesis? He got uh, he got fifth. fifth, fifth at Genesis, and then if he wins low tide, like that's a that's the second best in the world type of type of uh, you know, uh, performance. And he might win this TMT. Yeah, obviously. And uh, who would have thought that this is the timeline that we are living in? Because I'll be honest, I counted HBox out. I was like, no, Pip wins easy. You know, he's, he's been in solo battle enough times. And it's like, he's probably well prepared. HBox tends to not take this very seriously. 
but he's putting me wrong, and I'd love to see it. Um, I'd love to see it. And I uh, let's see what happens versus Ginger. I mean, they're up next, and we should see some clean ass melee. Uh, where it, honestly, comparatively, when it seemed when it, like there was like burst moments where Ginger looked really good, like destroying Ben, uh, getting the fourth sock on uh Ken. There's also a lot of weird moments where he just like killed himself, and like did bad decisions. And can you afford to do that against this type of H box that we're seeing? No. <laughs> He's got to no. step it up. He looks really good. Um, all right, so just talking about losers for a second, because that's happening while we're waiting for this winners. Mm -hmm. um, Mech had a pretty disappointing tournament, honestly. Ah. Um, lost ah. to Eric, a, a fox, and losers. Um, and, and Kevin winners, which is not as bad. But mm -hmm. um, Salt apparently went Ganon against no fluxes and won. Uh, I don't know if... If you want any of the Ganon games, no, he Whoa. lost the Ganon game. Yeah, he he, that's kind of funny. <laughs> okay, but he won. He won with Falcon. <laughs> he <laughs> won with uh, with the Falcon games. So that's I guess that's interesting. Salt J Flex is going to be happening in losers. Don't know who wins that. And then uh, JoJo's still in the tournament. JoJo is uh, hanging on. Going to play BBB. Pretty. He dropped the game against Akira's DK. Interesting. That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> and like Ikea stayed DK and lost but that, that's kind of interesting I guess I mean I would say that's DK Falcon on FD but that's still not that good well it's like yeah yeah it, 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 it was on FD so that makes sense but uh kinda yeah, I'm pretty sure Falcon combo's even harder <laughs> or as hard <laughs> <laughs> I don't know actually like DK He's deceptively hard to edge guard if your tag if your character is like not Falco. Mm. What does Falco do? Just let up down air? Yeah, just like put it there and like DK dies. But like every other character, like I don't know, like that up B hitbox is a lot better than you think. Yeah. Also, apparently, uh, the Hbox's stream went down. Oh, don't ruin the hype like this. No, no. Th that's the word I'm getting. Uh, well, here's the thing. Come back. <laughs> oh, and BB DQ'd? Yeah. Unbelievable. <laughs> don't do this to us. Don't do this to us. I, oh, in which case though, in which case though, if that oh, it's walks back. Right. Okay, okay, cool. yeah. I mean, like, I, 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 that, that's why I figured is that like his stream just temporarily went down. We're gonna see it again. Not a big deal. Mm -hmm. Um, though that would have been funny if I had made the hardest read of all time and Ginger just won that way. <laughs> that's like, that, that oh my count. god, how does he that see the count. game? <laughs> How does he see the game so differently? <laughs> oh, it would definitely count. It would de the question was, who wins the tournament? I would still get it right. We would give HBox time, and he would, he would have to beat HBox and losers. While we're waiting, there's a, uh, uh, a thread on Reddit right now that analyzes one million slippy matches. Have you seen this thing yet? It I was not. an hour, hour ago, so you might as well talk about it. Since we're here. Sure. Turns out Falco is the most common character. Which yeah. if you use Slipopedia, you already you already know that. I, I just knew that intuitively. Also, yeah. So it's Falco at 21%, Fox 19, Falcon 15, Marth 12. Uh Sheik is at six. So basically the top four most popular are like considerably more popular. Yeah. Uh, which we already knew if you play mm -hmm. the game. Um, Puff is more common than Peach. Falco, Fox, Falcon, and Martha are, are crazy common. Yeah. Um,